So yes, finally, 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 though of course I'm back with another really quick Pokemon video. So yeah, of course in the next episode, of course the Diamond Pro, with the special, you guys should not know, this is for the Brilliant Diamond Shiny Pro. Um, game release for Pokemon, of course, Brilliant Diamond Shiny Pro, so it really makes us enjoy that right, we watch those for years and everything. Of course though, and everybody knows going to always freak out about it, go crazy over it though, so of course it's the Winter, slash, you know, special for it, again, I said that for the Winter Pro, this is the part 2 of it, and the finale of it, of course. So basically in the first part, basically are not Distortion World, basically Palkia, Palkia, Dalkia. Palkia and Dalkia are fighting, they're um, kind of making like a big kind of war over everybody, but basically everybody's opposite of what they are. It's literally a mirror colors, basically, mirror colors copy episode, copy and paste, honestly. But yeah, um, basically, like that in general, in a nutshell, basically, though. So, yeah, uh, of course, everybody's just, you know, been swapped back and forth and stuff like that. Of course, the double is everybody sad, you know, not fake version of characters in front of the world, though. So, yeah, of course. Very, very difficult stuff. So, yeah, of course, I didn't call it exit. Actually, on end of another world, we're going, part one, um, going, um, Donald going from research, from a research standpoint of trying to, like, figure out what's going on. Of course, I didn't call it actually going inside the world, though, of course. And Dia's not here at all. She's just staying in the other world. So, of course, though, we see Ash and go, uh, Ash and Chloe, of course. I, I must have every review anyway, though. So, 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 we see Ash and Chloe actually, um, you know, all. Oh, that's going a bit tired. <laughs> I was making sure my videos go good and everything. Oh, no, that's only just a big thing. But yeah, of course, we yeah, have Ash actually introduced himself to Blue Ash right here. I was like, super saying Blue Ash, so of course, they just basically just, you know, just, you know, just going back and forth with everything. Of course, they're doing the opposite. Of course, of course, Chloe explains like, what's happening and everything. Like, why are all the fires disappearing? Why are all the fires disappearing? All the Pokemon and stuff like that are also disappearing. Of course, see, um, opposite Ash, because they have Pikachu and stuff like that. Because he doesn't have his Pikachu still in the egg and stuff like that, though. Because even Chloe and Ash see what the problem is and everything now that's Pikachu, his little Pikachu basically back to the egg. So yeah, of course Ash's Pikachu, Pikachu I think doesn't evolve into Pikachu in this episode. But yeah, of course we see how Ash basically explains the problem in the of course though. So yeah, of course Ash is still worried about his Pikachu. Of course he calls out Gengar and Dragon Knight. But um, I think the sole problem is that, yeah, basically just reacting and freaking out over everything, which I love though, of course. How Gengar super excited and um, <laughs> Dragon Knight super excited too. Uh, you know, a little, a little bit of opposite thing though, of course. I, mean, I see Professor Rowan there, of course we see Ash and um, we see Ash go, Blue Dawn, Regular Dawn, of course we see everybody basically catch up with each other. Uh, we see Professor Rowan, actually see me and other Professor Rowan, because like, like, we gotta see the differences too, the faces and everything. Of course, actually turned out to be Black and White Team Rocket, I'm calling Black and White Team Rocket, I don't care anybody says, they are Black and White Team Rocket, the ones we should have gotten in the beginning. Well, of course though, um, yeah, they basically just triggered my stuff like that, of course though, of course Pikachu and Sirius were called out, but, um, you know, Team Rocket is using further technology and we'll go with that, of course, to get them as the world, so they won't be affected and stuff like that, basically, though, of course. Um, yeah, of course, we see actually just, you know, they just shoot freaking Dark Pulse, by the way, though, so yeah, of course, we see Center Race, and of course, Pikachu probably going to action, but actually, they devolve into Rabu, back to Rabu, and, um, of course, Pikachu, so, of course, they're going to be and everything. Now, why do you do, like, damage, like, promotion images and, like, you know, video stuff, like, you know, I, I like it, I think it's pretty cool. It's also about, like, the kind of yeah, pick and see. But yeah, of course, Pikachu actually did wall back to Pikachu, and it's absolutely nice Ash's pocket, though. Of course, it's a Rabu reacting to this um, situation now and everything. It's weird, cause, you know, back, back when I was very rude, went for Rabu and everything, it's evolution and everything. Now, it's a reverse, I mean, yeah! I'm just getting of course. But yeah, also, though, um, yeah, see, Big Judge, P. Judge, and Ron Pock, and I actually did that myself, though. Professor Rowan also, you know, be like their double and their extra body and stuff like that, of course, basically just going over everything, of course, him and go, you know, being research perspective, um, people, basically just go with the situation and everything, and everybody just explains their, per their perspectives and everything on the situation that was going on, so yeah, all the Pokemon de-evolving, and their world Pokemon is still like a thing and everything, of course, they're big, and probably getting out of basically fighting the other world, of course, you see, actually, um, um, I think also, I think, um, I think they should go back to Wake, like way go back because we see Ash and Goes back as well. So you would see Dragonite and Gengar actually just keep trip default back to Hunter and um, um Dragonair. And of course we already yeah, so basically they didn't want to hunt the Pokemon though, so they keep on Pokeballs just in case. Because it's been just safe inside the Pokeballs basically though. Of course uh, with, with the limited time they have though, of course they call all the flying pet Pokemon sorry um going around and everything, of course um just like um, just figuring out what the problem is, of course it's very good to market actually coming the world, and of course they see um, Wolf of Fate go back to why not, so it's kind of cool. And yeah, I like this Wolf of Fate, it's really cool. Of course they actually go to the world, so they're just there though. They just probably like... Just... Look at this one Yeah, of course. Um, wrong. I put my mouse over the camera. But of course, though, we actually see on them, of course, like, they go to the world, so the portal of buildings and everything. Of course, because many stories of what happens in the world. Of course, we all, the, we see all, um, Ash, Go, Chloe, and of course, um, Go's opposites, of course. We're gonna get find out this technology that makes the Pokemon not get evolved and stuff like that. Of course, basically, it works in technology and they can kind of just steal it. So, right, you know, 
Actually, John joined with the regular Ash and Chloe. Regular Ash, Chloe, Don, and um, go all all together and just drive off the problem, fight problem, fight off all the problems, problem together and everything. Of course, but yeah. Let's see the world that I can pack here. I'm fighting this up of course. We see um, Team Rocky here, of course, with all the default Pokemon, all the regular ball Pokemon as well. So, um, yeah, of course. Um, but yeah, like I said, all the Pokemon are just starting to evolve back then. So, yeah, we see like, um, we see like Bion go all the way back though, because we see, um, I think, what is this? I can't remember who was the second one was though. We see them both from the evolve and stuff like that though. Hey, the 10k, let's all get 10k from Pokemon Go. I remember those. Adding those are a pain. But yeah, of course, um, all heroes get trapped together. You see all the Pokemon stuff that we see real. You tell them go back to um, Drizzle and um, uh, Riolu. We see um, so we see um, Bonsly. We see Breezel in there as well. Of course, we see um, White Team Rocket you know, doing all this stuff like that. Of course, they want to hold the world. Um, they want to see me dad in Pocket 5 and call the Pokemon Dia Ball and Bits for the world in general. But it's basically just for a whole entire play. Of course, see the opposite going opposite Ash, um, Chloe, and Dawn. Of course, I'll come in and help them today with using the technology for Team Rocket's um, plan, using the technology for Team Rocket and everything. Of course, basically, um, you know, then go, of course, we're going to go in Ash and meet um, the opposites and just basically tell everybody everything was going on and stuff like that. Of course, they also doing a big battle right now. Obviously, Green Eerie. People see P um, Pikachu Ash is shooting the best of this advantage using Pichu, of course. It'd be cool to see, like, just like, Thunder Shock and stuff like that, of course. Um, yeah, then, of course, um, our, uh, oh, but, like, Red Lash actually to pull the number card and calls out in front of though, but, of course, um, even as Red Lash being shot, but he calls out in front of holy crap. Of course, see all the Timbuk and Mario on each other. We see Rapid, of course, go all the way back to some Cinerate, Cinerate, so Rapid go all the way back to Score Bunny, though, which is crazy. Um, yeah, of course, see, um, regular, or at least he goes on Cinerate and stuff like that, battling, and obviously, Pip Love, Gallons, regular, regular, Gallons, but near, go out, see, boom, regular, don't call out, too. Because we, um, regular Chloe and, uh, um, Hopsy Chloe actually working together with the Eevees, which is really cool, like, Eevees more confident, this one's really, just, like, kind of shocked, and stuff like that, using Bubble Beam, using Helping Hand to kind of copy it and everything, of course. I think last was War, I think. I can't remember which one was it, though. But yeah, of course, um, they also are battling on the technology, it just starts to get messed up a little bit. Of course, opening different worlds, different passages, just you know, the patches and stuff like that, of course. And I feel like make all the Pokemon battle all the way back into eggs. So yeah, that kind of messed up. I'll get to it. Okay. But yeah. Um, let's see, like, um, they actually made all the Pokemon eggs go back to eggs. It wasn't their fault that they didn't know about it at all, though. So of course, um, you see everybody just, you know, kind of just clinging on, don't know what to do, though. So of course, if the eggs, they, this is my advice to Chris, they're going to see in the back as well as Sparkle Ash. Of course, all good idea to basically pray to their god, I'm not joking, I'm not really pray to their god. But yeah, of course, we, um, all of them basically banging together, putting together, making sure that um, they're all okay and everything, of course. And of course, the so they literally just prays together. I'm not just joking, even Sparkle Ash, obviously, Ash starts crying and stuff like that, of course. We see that, okay, back We also see a little bit of our scenes here as well, so they literally, funny joke I want to make this video, they literally prayed to Garcia, oh, Garcia is on my way. They prayed to Garcia, it's Garlic Garcia, they prayed to Green Arceus, they prayed to Arceus, it's literally their god. Because <laughs> it was like little hinting right there, so we could see Arceus coming in the series soon, probably for the, um, because this is basically the Demi Pro remix and everything, of course, event. So we also could, we also could see, um, what do you call it? We could also see, um, the Arceus Legends of it, because that game to come out as well, though, at the same time. I mean, you're like, early next year, January, whenever I want to By the time I upload this, it should be like 9 now yet, though, but it'll be way in January, though, so a little bit early January, though, so, um, yeah, of course, um, actually, after praying to their god, literally, um, they all basically, um, get back in there, get stopped, though, everything starts to go back together. Space and time starts to kind of restore itself back in that distortion world, though, of course. But yeah, of course, everything starts to go back to normal and everything, of course, everybody starts to go back to normal world, see where it goes, all the Pokemon actually get back to, um, to, to, to write their, to write their, to the right for evolution, um, parts. So, yeah, of course, there's a dragon there, um, go back to Dragonite, of course, Hunter go back to, um, um, Gengar, I say Ghastly, I, I always get all confused anyway. Of course, we see um, Team Rocket even get their Pokemon back, we see Regal Ash, and Opposite Ash, Pikachu back together as well, though. But yeah, really good ending, though. I really love the ending here, like oh, seeing all the other mirror opposites and stuff like that. We see, like, of course, Nerva Dawn, we see, like, Nerva Ash getting stronger, we see, um, of course, Regal Ash going. These, the regular the ghost for like saying anyway though so yeah of course the SEC color the Chloe's kind of far here like this is like we got like three clothes in like one series I don't know really I'm like Chloe she's a really good I feel like you're probably my favorite Pokemon girl I know a lot of people look at like oh Serena blah 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 because everybody did them all compared to Serena all day I was I personally feel like Chloe but hard honestly but yeah of course and um ends off there probably pretty much though everybody's saying they're and everything of course yeah even Cynthia just switching off the window like girl we're gonna see you next episode we're gonna see you like in the next 50 episodes for probably so um yeah yeah Forget Cynthia, she's a, she's a little side thing, of course. I'm joking, though, of course. Because you, you see Dabba, Dabba and Pokia go the distance, you see everybody running back, um, home and everything. Of course, there's a right, um, just rejoice for all the Pokemon coming back together in um, peace, harmony, and all that stuff, of course. Yeah, really good episode. I liked it, though. 
Honestly, like I really did like part one and two were really good. I like part one a little bit more because like, we got, got down back a little bit more. So we're creating for the chair. But yeah, we got down back a little bit more, which I love so much. We got, um, of course, the opposite goes. So basically being on the same opposite as being, again, like I said, it's literally X and Y, real universe all over again, though. So, um, yeah, you know, as crying up being confident, you know, John Cut being a little bit shy, instead of still being um, hopeful and energetic. We see, of course, Chloe, you know, you know, she's like quiet. She just like creeps through herself. She, can, she does have her like own moments and everything, of course. But then we also see like, her opposite basically being confident, like the, like her basically not clone, but her basically look like a better look like for Chloe episode. I'm say so yeah, again, it's a really good stuff in there. It's a really good character development and stuff like that. But it seems like the next episode, the episode will focus on Ash just going back into the more series because he's going to be fighting one of the Galar Ghost type two leaders. I can't remember his name for the for life. I mean, I know he's like a, like, he has like one of the new Galar Ghost Pokemon. I can't remember. It was like a coffee cup. I can't remember. It might have been that. I don't even know. I was like super shy and stuff like that. I seen his real face already. He's actually pretty cool. Um, I love how like his back was like he's just super nervous and shy. So he wears a mask. And, you know, when he's open to other people, he's like not shy. I'm probably gonna review the episode anyway. Whenever I have the time to, because again, like I said, um, yeah, I know it's all right now. Um, again, I feel like I've really had time to record some of this stuff though. So I was like. Oh, this will be back to recording this. Yeah, probably gonna go ahead and video there, like I said, back in Dalkin special, which are um for the damage from Coral event, of course. It was really good. I like I enjoyed it personally myself. I think it was really good. Bring Dawn back. I feel like this would have been a really good episode beforehand, not bringing Dawn back. They brought her back twice. And I'll be like, oh bring back, you know who twice and yeah, I don't think they're gonna do that again. If we get Dawn back for a third time, I'm not gonna be utterly, utterly, utterly shocked. And just saying it here, but I don't think we need to see Dawn for like another like two years. So we got her back in black and white, she was good. The dark, uh, dark, the dark, yeah, sorry, my first boy. The dark rye and Cresselio weren't that bad either, and also, um, but it was okay. I mean, the, the ending for that part two was way better part than part one, honestly. Personally, in my opinion, though, and Chloe Vision sent out by herself physically, though, while actually go doing their own thing. It was actually pretty cool, like her own like, journey and everything, of course, because it's supposed to be like a family vacation. Then, of course, they actually myself and get on this one tickets and everything. And it's like, okay, we're just gonna send Chloe off, like, See ya, here's Evie. Yeet. <laughs> yeah, gonna go ahead and end the video there. I like it though, get all the Pokemon D evolving going back. But they're using like their moves and stuff like that. They were really funny and cool. Seeing all the opposites and stuff like that, really good. Praying to their god, literally. <laughs> it's really funny. I love it so much. It was actually really good, in my opinion. I actually liked it. I liked to enjoy it. It was actually really, really funny and cool. And good. Again, like seeing all Pokemon use their moves and D evolves, like rap moves, like sir. Like, we have seen Pokemon probably almost like, what, two, almost three years now. It's insane. Like, Maybe two or three here now, probably next year. here. But yeah, really cool stuff, really insane stuff. I love it all. Like, we've seen Chimchar, um, when we call it, maybe we've seen like my friend, yeah, Chimchar, my friend, Chimchar Pichu. But, uh, <sighs> right there now, like the, you know, nowadays perspective. I love it. That was really good. See you guys there, though. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Good. Oh, you know, but you're like, they say, watch friends, comments, all people, I'll put this on my ass. Of course, though, so we're gonna, what do you guys think about all this? Of course, do you like to hate it? Can I love it? Have a good, awesome, beautiful, great, and stuff like that. Of course, though, but yeah. Um, yeah, I liked it. It was all good. Again, part one, part two. Again, I can gush about this all day. I love it so much. It's all good. Um, again, I mean, because, I mean, like I said, when Dog came back, part one sucked. I mean, Chloe going to send out. Some, some bright stuff was in there. I can know about, like, Chloe. Like, she always kind of reads out the characters for other people. See the journey, their perspectives, and stuff like that. I kind of learn more about herself and what she can do and everything. I know we're going to close another episode, though. But I love when you see her, obviously. Again, I want to see some more Chloe in the future. She's probably going to be Anyway, so, but yeah. See you guys later, though. Okay, though.